Overseas outreach is a very important aspect for the MRS, and we have two gentlemen joining us today to talk about it. We have Eric Garfunkel and Tecatel Johannes. Good day to you, gentlemen. Good day to you. Thank you. Rick, let's start with you, or Eric, I should say. Tell me a little bit about the focus of the outreach program as it relates to MRS. MRS has been involved for many years in international activities. As you know, many of the members of the NRS are coming into the U.S. to our regular biannual meetings in, New York, in Boston and San Francisco for the meetings. We also have many activities overseas, such as running workshops. We do publications. We collaborate and coordinate and partner with international societies and organize meetings overseas. Some of the places we've been involved with recently have included uh, Brazil, India, China, Singapore, Mexico. There's a regular large meeting with Mexico and uh, more and more now um, other parts of the world which haven't been reached previously such as Africa. And speaking of Africa, that's where Tecatel comes from, Ethiopia to be more specific. So what is your role with the MRS as it relates to Africa? Uh, I'm the uh, board member of the African MRS and I'm the local organizing committee of the Sevens Biannual uh, African MRS Congress that is going to be held next year uh, between December 8 uh, and, and 13 in Ethiopia, uh, which is the capital of Africa. Now, is that the first time you've had something like this in Ethiopia? Uh, MRS, yes. 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 So it's going to be a big deal, and you're trying to invite as many people there as possible, I imagine. Yeah, that's true, and that's, that's why I'm here. How important was it for you to travel all the way from Ethiopia to Boston to attend this meeting? What are you hoping to accomplish? One, uh, I, was, I was involved in, in, in attending, uh, you know, uh, uh, symposia, uh, which are also related to my research area. Uh, I, I was attending symposia O and H, uh, which are related to organic solar energy conversion, which is, which is one of my area. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to be there because uh, I, I was uh, uh, coming and attending uh, uh, you know, latest areas where, where people are pre presenting uh, in, uh, there. So I'm really happy to be there. And I'm also happy to be here uh, you know, to talk about the uh, next uh, year's uh, meeting, African MRS meeting. Well, we're happy to have you. Now, Eric, you're organizing a forum for this meeting. What is that going to be about? So the forum is about people who are interested or in Africa or engaged in Africa from the materials research world in the U.S. and, and elsewhere in the world. So um, the session will be a relatively small session tomorrow morning from 8 to uh, noon. We will have speakers from Africa such as Tecatel. We'll have speakers from the U.S. funding agencies who are involved with Africa, a few people who are currently quite involved in African exchanges, educational exchanges, as well as others who do meetings and workshops and summer schools in Africa that are going on uh, at all times. So they will be presenting and talking about their current activities or their activities um, that they're planning for the near future. So it's somewhat of a networking event tomorrow where people talk about their uh, research and we have a discussion and some, some panel discussion. So ideally that's what you're hoping to achieve through the forum, just having different people from different places meet each other and network? Network those who are engaged or would like to become engaged in, in African activities, yes. So a kind of a networking event, yeah. Eric Tecatel, thank you for joining us today. We appreciate your time. Thank you. Thank you.